Thank you for watching KHSD News. I'm Erin Briscoe Clark. This is one of the most symbolically important buildings in our nation. Can you name it? Bakersfield High government students were put to the test to answer similar questions as the Earl Warren Cup returned to BHS. Good evening and welcome to the 2019 Earl Warren Cup. The Harvey Auditorium was packed. The energy from the crowd was loud. Thirty-two top government students studied countless hours on every aspect pertaining to the U.S. government. I've got a pen and I've got a phone as a way of threatening Congress with what type of presidential action? Um, an executive order? Correct. One Teachers Jeremy Adams and Kevin Rainier led the fast-paced question and answer competition. Um, feeling nervous, a little anxious, but mostly excited. It's been three years since this has been around, and I'm glad to see it come back. In 2016, Adams was adamant it was the last Earl Warren Cup. So why did he bring it back? It was more than just pressure. It was also this idea that there is so much toxic uh, discourse, so much negativity about something that should be inspiring. That is the idea, the beauty, the splendor of America. Uh, and I wanted to show this community and, and maybe even show this country that democracy is possible if we believe in our students enough uh, and, and if we g give them a chance and an opportunity and a platform to succeed, like the Earl Warren Cup, look what can happen. The event was entertaining just as much as it was educational, with some big names lending a hand, like Bill Gates. Who is the current Secretary of State? Congressman Kevin McCarthy, even the president, made an appearance. But in the end, only one student could win the coveted cup. Nico Stason explained why this win was extra special. It means a, it means a whole lot, especially since I'm a well, my family immigrated here from South Africa before um, we became American citizens last year. So it feels amazing to win a competition based around the, com the country that's not my home. What an inspiring evening. The depth and the breadth of knowledge is just inspirational. I am so proud of these young people. The Earl Warren Cup is named after Earl Warren, a BHS grad who went on to be the governor of California, then appointed chief justice of the U.S. Supreme Court. Thank you for watching KHSD News. I'm Aaron Briscoe-Clark. See you next time.